Some supplies necessary for canning apples would be a colander, your mason jars with lids and rings, a knife, sharpie for marking jars, chopstick for removing air from the jars, an apple slicer and core comes in handy, funnel for filling your jars, the water bath canner with its supplied rack, tongs for handling hot items, and jar tongs. These items are all available at your local grocery and hardware stores. First order of business is to wash your jars in hot soapy water, as well as your lids and rings. After washing your jars and lids, take your lids, place them in a pan of water, put the heat on ultra low. Remember not to boil your lids. We take our washed jars, place them in an oven that's been preheated to 265 degrees to keep them hot until it's time to pack them and put them in the canner. Selecting your fruits is very important. It has to be fresh, free of bruises and blemishes, preferably a local farmer's market or an orchard. The fresher the better. After washing, peel, slice, and core. After having peeled and sliced your apples, simmer them for 10 minutes on the stove top alongside the juice that you're going to use to fill your jars with. Here we have apple juice with a cinnamon stick and some cloves in it. Notice also our water bath canner is coming to a boil. Pretty soon we're going to be ready to pack our jars, put them in there, and get the processing going. Removing your hot jar from the oven, place your funnel on top, pack your apples into it, give it a little shake, make sure you got enough room, and go ahead and take your spiced juice or syrup, filling up to about a half inch of the bread. So after you've packed your jars with your apples and filled it with your liquid, you want to wipe the rim of the jar to make sure that they're nice and clean. Put on your hot lid, spin down your ring, finger tight, and place it into the canner, waiting for the others. We have a full canner. Lower it down via the rack, making sure that the jars are covered at least an inch by the boiling water. Water comes to a boil, start your timer, 15 minutes, cover it up. After 15 minutes of processing, remove the jars from the canner. Do not retighten the bands. Check for a good seal. The lid's down, sounds good. I don't hear a ping. Let them cool, 24 hours to room temperature. Wipe them off with a damp cloth and put them away.